Welcome to the Pro Camera tutorial series. In this video, I'll show you Pro Camera's XF Metadata Viewer, where you can view and inspect all the important information of your photo or video capture. There's also a Maps feature to track the precise spot where you shot a particular photo, along with a compass to help show you the way back for future shooting sessions. Plus, stay tuned until the very end for some tips on how to more easily share your favorite photos with family and friends. First, select any photo in your camera roll inside Pro Camera. Then tap the Info button to reveal the XF Metadata Viewer panel. The top row shows the capture date, file name, and timestamp. The next row gives you info about the pixel size and file format of your capture. Here you can see specific camera values related to exposure, ISO, and more. And finally, on the last row, we see information connected to the precise location of where your capture was taken. This geodata will only be available with geotagging enabled. If geotagging is disabled or there's simply no geodata present in the capture for one reason or another, then no information will be displayed here. If needed, you can also double tap on the panel to reveal an extensive rundown containing even more precise details about your capture. Swipe left to reveal the map screen. Again, you'll need to have geotagging enabled to view this information. If you don't see it displayed, head on over to the settings and turn geotagging on. That way the necessary geodata will be embedded automatically for future photos and videos. You don't need Wi-Fi enabled for this feature to work, just your mobile data. Back to the map screen, here you can see a preview of where you were standing when you took your shot, as well as the direction you were facing when the capture was taken. Double tap to expand the map. You can also switch to the satellite view if you like. Tap the location once, then tap again to open in the Maps app. From there, you can find your way back to the precise location of your photo. Tap to return to the map screen in Pro Camera. Then swipe once more to reveal the photo compass. Notice how the compass responds live to your change in direction to help you find the exact spot, even without Wi Fi. Double tap to expand the panel. Here again, you have the option to open the Maps app and find your way back to your photo location. Sometimes when you open a photo, you might see more than one version listed here. For instance, if you've edited your photo or shot in RAW plus JPEG format. In this case, an edited version of my photo is currently open, but I can tap here to instantly switch to the original photo before I made any adjustments. And you can also tap here to switch between versions of your photo. When sharing an individual image, the currently selected version is the one that will be shared, in this case, my edited photo. Just tap the share icon here to do so. Now here's a pro tip. Long press the share icon for extra share options. Now you have the option to change the file size, convert your image to a JPEG if necessary, and remove the geotag. Selecting this option gives you extra privacy, as the geodata will remain visible only for you and not the person who you share the photo with. You also have the option to share all versions of your photo, in case you have multiple versions like I just showed you. Back in your Pro Camera camera roll, you can also quickly select or deselect multiple photos. Just tap here first, then swipe or tap to make your selections. Then share as usual. One last note to mention is that everything I've shown you is also available for your video captures as well. I hope you found this tutorial useful. If you don't have Pro Camera yet, there is a download link in the description so you can easily find it on the App Store and learn more about it. Also, Pro Camera recently launched a big update for iOS 17, including Apple ProRes recordings and log profile on iPhone 15 Pro, as well as the ability to record to an external USB-C drive. To stay up to date on all the latest features, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching.